In this video, I'm going to be explaining and showing you how to sell and transport cows to and from the animal dealer and between barns and pens uh, in Farming Simulator 22. So let's get into it. All right, let's talk about um, the best time to sell cows. Now, basically the whole stands we've already talked about, you don't really want to sell them because they're going to be your dairy cows producing milk. So if you're going to go down the milk path, that's these are the ones you want to keep, okay? What you do want to be mindful of with the the dairy cows is when they reproduce that if you are going to expand your farm operation um, to get more cows into different barns and pastures to build out your number of barns and number of cows potentially you can look at using mods that will have big, bigger capacity barns but if you're using base game uh, buildings you are limited to the amount that the barn holds and you won't be able to produce any more cows after that now in terms of the cattle cows so we've got a range of cattle here and I've fast forwarded time up to the peak price of $3,500 at 30 for 35 months so 36 months I believe it is so at 34 months now we're 3416 so basically what we sh what we would expect to see is when we hit 36 months uh, this guy will hit three and a half thousand in in uh, in value and then we'll sleep for one more day at 36 months we'd expect to see that price start to come back down so let's go and cycle through some sleep days and we'll check in and see what happens all right here we are 35 months so 36 months one day to get one more month to go to peak price so you can see the price has gone up again uh, the other guys will come up in price as well but i just want to really showcase what happens um, to the peak price and then the the decline okay so let's go ahead and sleep one more day all right here we are 36 months so you can see there 3500 36 months that's basically the peak price for our uh, beef cattle. So this is the Limerson and the Angus. So we've got the Angus in this pen just to just to show that. You can see the price fluctuations between the different age groups. Now if we compare that in price to a calf. So if we look at the animal dealer, we can see a zero month Angus starts at $300 plus a transport fee of $50. So $350 investment. So that's a 10 times return using my maths on what we see here okay so not a bad so not a bad not a bad return on investment okay now so this is 36 months let's sleep for one more day and we should see the value of this angus drop down and you can see here 37 months of age it's now dropped from 3500 to 3458 so basically what this tells you is that 36 months is the peak price so whenever you get a an Angus or a Limerson that is $3,500 in value, that's when you want to sell it. Okay, so that is the highest they will go. They won't go any higher. And if you hang on to them, they'll still reproduce for you, but basically they start to lose their value. Okay, so how do we go about selling these guys? Let's have a look at that. All right, so here we are at the cow barn where the Anguses are. So you can see them in there. Easiest way to sell them is to come over to the animal dialogue, animal dealer dialog box, open that up. So we're in the this particular barn you can see on our right hand side here our stock of cattle okay so we've got we've got our 37 month angus here so if we select that um, pick the quantity that we want to sell we've only got one so it's going to charge us a fee of hundred dollars to transport this to the animal dealer which is over on the other side of the map uh, so we do get a reduced uh, cost so let's sell that guy and there we go we've sold him for 3358 now if you want to sell them without taking the hit uh, with the transport fee what you want to do is you want to come over and grab an animal transport trailer so animal transport you've got a couple of different options here you've got the silver star trailer which will hold Old 12 cows or you've got the Flegel Noah which will carry six so let's grab the Silver Star you just need an appropriate truck as well so all you need to do is hook up your trailer now the reason why you'd want to use a trailer like this is because it allows you to transport not only animals to and from the animal dealer but animals from pen to pen as well so what I'm going to do is just to demonstrate this we've got a 63 Holsteins in this pen here or this part this barn what I'm going to do is I'm going to move these some of these guys over into one of the pastures so just say for example we had to make room for some offspring okay or we wanted to expand into a different barn basically just drive up to the animal dialogue box trigger which is the poor icon just there so we get the dialogue box so basically it tells you on the left hand side we've got the silver star which is empty and then we've got the holsteins on the right hand side which are grouped by age okay so let's go the 19 monthers let's have a look at them so we've got one of those 34 monthers we've got 12 so 12 is the maximum that this, this trailer can carry okay so it allows us to select 12 let's go move to trailer those cows have now been moved and we can see them sort of on board there so what I'm going to do is I'm going to drive this guy over to this pasture here so generally speaking we should just be able to drive up get that get that dialogue box 
to open. So we've got the silver star on the left. Select that. Select the number that we want to move to husbandry. And we can now we can now see they're in their new home. Okay. So basically let's say let's go back over to our Angus and let's take a couple of them to the animal dealer for sale. All right, so we just come over like we did to the other barn, over to the animal dealer icon, open it up. Let's just grab let's just grab one of these. So move to trailer. So we've got one on board. We're going to drive over to the animal dealer. So the animal dealer, if you didn't know, is located over here on Elm Creek. So that's that there. So I'm just going to go tag place. And now we've got a green beam of light to signify where we've got to drive to. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to drive this guy over. We'll sell him and then we'll come back in. All right, here we are at the animal dealer. So basically what we're going to do is we're going to drive on in to this loading area just here. So we'll get the icon, open animal dealer dialog box. So we've got the Silver Star trailer. We've got our one Angus. We're going to sell that. Now, ideally, you wouldn't just sell one with the trailer. You'd have a full trailer load of 12 to sell, um, and that'll give you a significant amount of money uh, if they're at peak price. And now what we're going to do is we're going to take uh, a bunch of limousines back to the farm. So we're going to go the zero monthers. We're going to grab 12. We've got 12 on board, so you can sort of see them in there. It's a little bit hard to see, but let's drive back to the farm, and then we're going to throw them into the pen and basically the cycle continues so basically every time you have 12 cows to sell what I, what I would do is I would take them over sell them grab another 12 and then basically just repeat the process okay so you've always got a you've always got a sort of couple of groups on the go and at different stages throughout the game and different different months you'll you'll have you know 12 cows ready to go for sale and you just basically keep rotating through that cycle as long as they're fed and looked after and all that sort of stuff uh, the other the other benefit to selling the cattle along with pigs are very similar is the price doesn't fluctuate so all year round you'll get three and a half thousand max price on easy economy for the beef cattle okay so it's not it's not um doesn't fluctuate like the crops do at different times of the year it's uh, very very stable okay so that's another added benefit of doing it this way uh, and also utilizing the trailer we can basically on our way to the animal dealer we're loaded on our way back from the animal dealer we're loaded so we're not wasting any um time and space with the movement of the animals as well so here we are at the pen so it's all the pasture sorry the barn keep getting them confused open the animal deal animal dialog box We've got the Limissons there, 12, move them to husbandry, and they are now in the barn. Pretty straightforward, okay? So you can start to see how we can expand our, our cow cattle operation based on being able to move animals from one pasture to another. And the only way to do that is with a trailer similar to this. You can't move cattle or, or cows from pen to pen or pasture to pasture in this menu all has to happen with a trailer okay so that's another reason why you'd want to look at using a trailer if you were going to look to expand out your farm farm operation that way all right let's move on so there you have it guys my guide on how to sell and transport cows in farming simulator 22 if you like this video uh, leave a like on it if you've got any questions leave a comment below if you want to see my full cow uh, tutorial for beginners i'll leave a link in the description otherwise i'll see you in the next one and bye for now